What's up, gamers? Welcome to Winner's Quarters of Xeno 161. We got Dills Rob fighting off against Ralphie, HO3 Classic. I forgot the K in HO3. The K was for Classic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, like Mortal Kombat or Kremlings from Donkey Kong Country. I see you. 100%. Anyways, Ralphie making his way to Winner's Quarters. Uh, my man has been uh, hurting a little bit trying to find his way into this brand new game, but he did get fifth at Spectrum on Monday. Been traveling a lot, been grinding hard. He's looking for a big win. This could be the win he needs to find that confidence, to get that momentum back. But can he beat Father Dill? By blood, Dill is Ralphie's father, by the way. All right, here we go. So Pokemon Stadium 2, this big open stage. Plenty of room to move around. That, that uh, blaster from Wolf will pretty much go over half the distance of that stage. So it's a fantastic stage. Wolf on top of the side is being able to cancel on the platform. But just for Dill, my man likes a long open range. They can be able to catch those lasers. And my man loves those down tilts. It's a lot of mileage of them. Both of them at high percent on this first stock. Not too much action happening beyond this. Looking for that Nair confirm. Gets caught by the gyro. Unfortunate for Ralphie. Just slipped up ever so slightly and pays the ultimate price for it. There we go. 157% on Dill. Offstage pressure for Mr. Ralph. I like these combos. Hold on a second. He got 62 damage off of that. 81. He died? Is that a zero death? Dill, chill. I need, I, need, I, need, I need that to be on Twitter later on, Devin. Oh, there we go. We got another kill. Ralphie has one stock to two. Waits for the shield grab. Goes with the up throw. Tacks on the damage. And whatever, any any sort of like, uh, like even neutral that these two players had is now just gone in a heartbeat. Dill has stolen the momentum of this game. Ralphie shouldn't give up just yet, though. He is playing Wolfman. If there's a character can make a comeback, it's him. He's got to play the edge, play patient, play nice and easy. Dill being the previous Xeno champion. Okay, good. Spacey from Ralphie able to avoid that gyro by trying to recover high instead with the upbeat getting back onto the stage. Now Dill's looking for these down tilts. Well, I'm just in time for Robert to try to get back on the stage. As I get back on the mic, what's going on, everybody? You missed a zero death. He missed what? A zero death. Dill no. destroyed Ralphie. It, oh, was, it was sad. I felt bad for him. And Speaking now he's sad. <laughs> Ralphie's going to be crying. He's hurting. He's wiping his nose, itching his eye. He's wiping those tears away for a game, too. So now, I've spoken with Dill. Um, so we can see right here in the replay, he was at about 120. Um, most people have a difficult time mashing out of that. I know we saw Bonkai last week, and he was mashing out at about these percents. Apparently, he was breaking his controller. Apparently, numbers can do it up until like 140. These guys are really good at breaking their controllers. <laughs> They're really good at pushing buttons as fast as possible. And we all know whoever pushes the button faster is, in fact, the better player. If there's anything Mario Party is topping, it is that salt one truth. Yes. Pushing the button as fast as your opponent, Three, and I believe two, uh, one, BMing as much as possible. Go. Mario Party. Yes. Does that oh, definitely. Hey, Stinky. Here we go. <laughs> Smashville. Already got Dill at 23%. Ralphie's stealing that stage control a little bit. See if you try to turn this into anything. So interesting pick from Ralphie. One of the main things to look for here is that this is the shortest legal stage currently online. So uh, less room for Dill to set up his setups. And also, uh, this is just going to be a fantastic stage for uh, Wolf. You know, uh, what stage isn't fantastic for him, man? I'll be honest with you about it. Smash Bros. got that, like I said, it's really short. No, he's not. Oh, oh okay. Okay. dear. That was okay. still dangerous. No spike. No spikies. Honestly, Rob, with how big he is, I wouldn't have been surprised if he dipped into the spike hitbox. I was expecting something crazy. There. And you saw Ralphie looking for that down smash. Point point. Dill does that a lot. He does it the exact same way every single time. <laughs> he'll hover there and then he'll come up with like some sort of attack. And I can't wait till someone punishes the crap out of that. Yes. The one thing about that mix-up, however, is that the alternative is uh, he just goes back up and boosts the stage. Um, yeah. 
which a lot of characters give up their ledge pressure to do that, but Wolf has a wonderful down smash, a forward tilt, where he could potentially cover both. So let's see if Ralphie adapts to that. Yo, you want to see something cool? Ralphie, hit down on the C-Stick. He was thinking about it. Uh, all right. He's he thinking. definitely was thinking about it. He's, he's hearing you. He's going to carry it over to the next stock. I'm already feeling it. He was going to down smash out of shield, but it's okay. We're back at uh, disadvantage state. Good recovery. Yes. The gyro, gyro did come back into play. saved him? Gyro both saved him and condemned him back to the ledge. Where right. He's going to have to struggle back. Out of the fryer and into the frying pan, man. He honestly kind of lucked out on that one. He kind of lucked out that uh, <laughs> <laughs> Ralphie's shaking his head like, yeah. Thank I mean, you, Gyro. We take those, man. Back throw and he's off stage again. Yep, air dodge is spent. Did his his sword beat the gyro? And yes, Wolf's sword is a gun. Is a sword? It's a gun blade. Yo, I traded. Oh. oh, okay, got him off stage. All right, does it once more. Right. Yep. Yep. Dill loves going for that. Dill. Okay, bye, Ralphie. One eighty-two percent. I mean, not <laughs> not the worst time, Dusty. No, no. You know, I think maybe he just wanted a fresh stock. You know, he thought, man, I don't want to have to play off stage against this Rob. Let me just restart. Let's get. No, he definitely here. messed up. Yeah. <laughs> he definitely. He definitely did a bonkers moment. Oh. Well. Sometimes that happens. Sometimes uh, you gotta hold that. Honestly, as much as we like to say, like, oh, you know, we take those. Sometimes you just have to hold the hard L. Sometimes you have to hold the hardest. The bull L. Oh yeah. Oh, here we go. Nice cross up from Ralphie. See that sneaky back air? Good job on his part to diffuse pressure from Dill. Getting back to stage pretty well, too. He's being patient here, waiting on the fares. A punishable option on its end lag. And there we go. So what? Ralphie actually punishing Dill's little tricker. Tricky wanna, my bob. You want to know why? It's because he has me percent. He's got 69%. That's the first time Dill, uh, Ralphie's actually gone for an up smash, too. <laughs> which is one of Wolf's, like, best tools besides down smash. Wolf's uh, And F-tilt. And jab. And blaster. And anyways, 91%. What, is, what, what isn't good off of Wolf, really? Um... Not going off stage. Oh, Whoa, nearly gets cut. Get Jesus. All right. That was scary. Take the wheel. Off stage. Laser. Oh, okay. He saved his didn't double jump. jump. Yep. Now he is, he is very dead. He was trapped. Dill, literally, the second he saw him falling like that, he knew he was going to go for a side B recovery onto the ledge. Dill had that option covered. Hey, look, he, he, he gave him, this man gave him the Phoenix right, okay? He said, I got evidence. You're going to air dodge right here. Oh, oh, oh. You're gonna use your jump. Oh! No, You're gonna side and now, oh! and now my man needs a phoenix down. To try to get this uh, stock back. Mm -hmm. Doing a go. good job and pushing him back off the stage here. <laughs> Dash dancing, mixing it up, keeping it crazy. And Dill looking a little shook for a moment there in shield. Uh, well, that F smash would not have taken it, would it? it I hope it, not. It would, I don't know, man. He's at 81 on the edge of the stage. Thing is, he originally went for that forward smash is because Dill was spamming spot dodge for a second. That would have called him out. Absolutely. Whoops, spot dodge. Here got goes just the Yep. Oh, see, he's he's learning. He's trying to go for that. He grabbed and tried to uh, get him on shield, but crossed up with it. Oh! Ballsy get up attack, but it does stick on the gyro, which keeps the hitbox out a little bit longer. Dash attack. All right, got him back off stage. Will he Poke. have the punish? No, yes, he, he does. does. Now. He had the punish. There right. you go. Very nice. Ralphie played patient right there. Because you notice that Ralphie held Whoa. shield, which is the safest option to do against Rob when he's in that situation. You might not get the strongest punish, but if Dill goes for something risky like a blast point blank, then yes, you will have to go for a forward tilt out of shield, which is exactly what Ralphie did. He got the kill. It brings us to a game three situation. So sometimes safest option is best. Yes, absolutely. And especially with a, move, uh, a game like this with so much mobility and with characters, especially higher tier your characters and characters with fleshed out kits. Uh, there really are a lot of options. So Ralphie taking the patient one here, waiting it out and not fully uh, set in for his punish is honestly the strongest option. That's the strongest learning option is to wait and see what you can do. And he did. He adapted very well to that. We call that the W and S. Why is it the W and S? Wait and see. <laughs> oh, that was that was corny. Uh, nah, we're going to nah, jump nah. into this next game. Stop switching care Ralphie, I swear to if he selects Pichu, I'm going to go out there. Okay, there we go. Okay. That is Ralphie's biggest problem, dog. He can't just play a character. Just play Wolf! He doesn't have bad matchups! <laughs> he probably does have bad matchups, but, like, they're not... They're not there, there's no matchup Wolf he, can't, like, yeah. overcome, in my opinion. Exactly. As, as far as characters go, I think the only characters that might have a better matchup spread than Wolf are, like, Lucina, maybe. And even then, that's still called into question because Wolf has a great projectile. Use it right there, but not going to be able to pull out this matchup too much because Rob has better projectile control overall. But it's still a very strong move. Good job calling him out on the shield. 
Ralphie carrying a lot of momentum in the beginning of the stock. This would be a very important victory for Ralphie to not only overcome Winner's Quarters for the first time, but overcome Dill, who has been on a on, on a tear lately at Zeno, as well as being his father, related by blood. <laughs> he has been absolutely unstoppable lately in that. Oh, shoot. Oh. All right, Gadol takes his jump, but size beats back to stage, doesn't get any punch forward. Guys, go for a hard read on the forward smash, but nothing off of it. Oh, okay, good DI, very nice. Okay, so the nair. The See, that nair is so tricky in cross-up situations like that. You gotta be ready for both hits. Back for a little bit of safe pressure. Oh, okay, yeah, I respect that. I respect that because Dill has been predictable with those so often that Ralph is like, you know what? I'm just going to go for it, even though I'm Wolf. Sometimes it's okay to go off stage. He, uh, oh, he's in his double jump. He, he saw him trying to space that side B to avoid that arm rotor, but Dill was just a hair too close. Got to connect, gets the stock, and uh, that's still taking the lead. And all that momentum Ralph had. He usually take that back. And that's really the thing, is that no matter how much Wolf is touted as being excellent, he still does have a vulnerable recovery period. No air dodge, no jump, makes it very difficult for him to get back. He's got to choose one of two options, and if he chooses wrong, he can very well die for it. Opting to just retreat from that with him holding shield, because Dill's hungry for that grab. Now, you saw right there that Ralphie actually jumped out of that pressure string and avoided the down tilt. Could have maybe come down with an air, but that is one of the ways to answer that. You see how much damage you got off that down yeah. tilt up air, <laughs> baby, not going to let you land. Laser, 89, oh my God, 89. Just can I see some more? Our rotor, you're done! Jesus, just put everything in Wait. the shopping cart already. Wait, Take this man to checkout. Wait, Dill God. goes through checkout, man. <laughs> he he does so much work. He, all he needs is that little bit of momentum, and he becomes one of the oh, scariest no. players in NYC. Okay. I yeah, thought he was going to start doing it again. Got him. All right. The trip ups. Things are not Laser. looking too good. This is over, <laughs> dude. And that's going to be a three stock from Dill. You can tell by Ralphie's face he looked mentally defeated from that loss, especially when he was so close. You saw him with a pretty healthy lead in that first stock, but then after that it was just like, that's all she wrote, man. Dill showing why he's he, he's sitting, he's pretty high in that PR, but probably going to be way better off on the next season. He 